Hello guys and welcome to a new tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to link two text boxes on your documents in Adobe InDesign. So the first thing that I want you to do now is to open your Adobe InDesign software and follow the simple steps. So here in this example I'm going to create two text boxes and I'm going to show you how to link them. So the first step is going to the type tool here in your toolbars, uh, your tools bar and search for the type tool or you can just click on the T key on your keyboard and you will have uh, your uh, type tool used. Now I'm going to use two text box. I'm going to fill them with fill with placeholder text. You can do it here in the type, go down and click on pl fill with placeholder text. I'm going to add another text box and I'm going to fill it uh, with placeholder text and now I want to uh, link my two text box. So basically I will need to select one of the text box. So this is uh, my first text box here. Uh, let's just select it. And now I will need to click on this uh, white square here. You can either use this one or this one depends on the position of the link. So basically I'm going to click on this one and as you can see I'm uh, like transferring or linking this text with this text box and when I'm dragging the, the mouse here you can see the link uh, icon. So I'm going to click on it and now I have my uh, link that has been settled successfully. So basically if I'm going to resize or increase the size of uh, my text box the second one or the text on the second one will go up there because now they become one text or because they are linked. We can do with another option by clicking on the first square and going like this and now uh, the text from up will go down if we have some space as you can see even if I, if I have enough space here my text doesn't go up because I linked this one so the text from the first one will go down and not the reverse as we did previously. So basically if I'm going uh, to resize this one uh, the text from uh, the first text box will go down to this text box. And you can do the same with all the text box that you have uh, in your document and you can choose uh, however you want to position your text box and to have your text positioned on your pages on your documents in Adobe InDesign. So basically and simply this is how you can do it. Thank you for watching and see you next time.